what are the things that are deal breakers for uh, engineers this like basically how people compare there, there are two aspects which are very very important one is your employer brand and and as a consequence of this how what people say about you right so here say and two things that are very important for this is like one is like how how do people rate you on glassdoor glassdoor is is probably the first place that where any engineer joining you would go and check about you what are the other engineers saying about you so having a great rating there that helps a lot two is the second thing that which any engineer would do is go and look up on linkedin what kind of people already work with you if they are the kind of people that you that are really aspirational um again joining ratio actually becomes much much better otherwise it becomes it almost remains a challenge the third thing which actually drives the hearsay is the interview experience it was very important that people who get selected have a very positive experience but it, it's equally important that people who are getting rejected also have an equally good experience usually the founders aren't the one who are guilty of causing bad experience to anybody but as you scale the team as you scale the interviewing team what happens is that your your newer interviewers they don't know what to prioritize versus what to not it's it's only a thing of communication anybody who is going to take interviews at your company uh, have some form of um, onboarding for new interviewers just in terms of interview training which is more of making sure that people have very high nps when it comes to interviewing with you uh, make sure every single interviewer who you are leaving on their own have gone through a shadow and reverse shadow so that they know what company values to pitch uh, what kind of experience to ensure um again i can't take names of companies but there have been cases in in a lot of companies especially early stage startups where uh, the experiences have been non ideal just to say I mean, i'm just toning it down a lot but <laughs> but but there have been a lot of unpleasant things said in the interviews which does not really bode well for the future hiring aspects of the company make sure even a person being getting rejected leaves with a positive experience they leave with an understanding of why they got rejected and therefore um, have a positive um, view of your company these are equities that you build over a period of time hard to change and in just one day two days